Okay, so if you throw the jab cross. So last time we covered some of the elbow progressions in Kali, and there's always a big discrepancy, uh, or a big discussion, I should say, with our destruction. It doesn't matter what it is. So if you just throw a jab punch, I mean jab cross, it doesn't matter if it's that one, it doesn't matter if it's this one, it doesn't matter if it's that one, but people will always have some sort of, um, you know, critique as far as like our destructions and what they're supposed to do and if they'd work and you know this person would never leave that cross out so I can do a billion different things and all of that is true but some of it is that this is a lot of the ways that Kali has always decided to teach and present the art and as far as its destructions but in reality it's true of a jab cross I probably don't have the time because he's gonna draw this punch back so that's why at times we will emphasize like the entry itself so when he draws that does that cross that pulls back I'm already here I can still get that when the punch comes back in we showed it like this but it can also be in these kinds of motions here too so if Christopher throws a fast jab cross that retracts then I can still have these kinds of motions as I'm coming through so the hands can actually be up if I've come up here I can still rock the elbow I can still rock the bicep and I can still come in with all these other things on that side the other thing is a lot of times we're going to be in this kind of standing grapple clinch kind of motion so as Christopher's kind of trying to come through I can get all these strikes onto that side he may be trying to punch me like he could be reaching to punch he could be reaching to grab so as I have that I can get all my destructions on that side too if I come in on the inside so he throws a jab cross and I'm coming in on the inside now I'm just attacking the outside elbow but from the inside so I have this here and I have this here this can all happen in these standing grapple kind of positions we're trying to fight for position and I'll look for these as I'm starting to come in the last way is if Christopher let's say I you know let's say he throws a cross it doesn't matter if he throws a cross and then I have these and as I'm coming through I still have all these motions because I'm looking at how I can control with the blade now he may throw a fast cross that retracts or if he's trying to stab, he may actually be going with a, a thrust that he's really going to commit to. So if he's if that's there, then I have all these other positions too. So we like to show we like to show the uh, destructions in this punching format. So when he's here, and we'll do all these things. But remember that it's not always going to look like that in combat. It can be like this: he throws a fast cross, I could retract, and I still have these things coming in but I'm still trying to work on the inside. It can be that he retracts and he's, let's say he's trying to shoot in for like a double leg. No, I can have this here. I can go for this here. These are not fight enders, not like any destruction will be a fight ender, but they're moments in time where I can look to come in and take some shots while I can. Obviously there's a size discrepancy, there's a height and uh, maybe a strength or technique discrepancy, but I'm looking for these shots on the inside. So as I come through, that's where all my destructions would be. If I can do it as a jab cross and get these five elbows in, that's awesome. I know that I may not. So if he, he pulls back, he throws a jab cross and pulls back, then I'm still looking on the way in to do other things. So that's a little bit of an additional add-on to whenever we're showing our elbow progressions or uh, destructions. Usually these are kind of taught in classes, so if you're only learning uh, Kali or martial arts by Instagram, you're not going to get all the details, but a lot of times if you're with a good instructor, they'll be able to explain how these things will, will look at and relate in uh, different kinds of contexts.